Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I am Cosman L.D. Sims. Mama Felicia, Book of Sims. <laughs> Cosman L.D. Sims. Elder Cosman E. Sims. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm um, here mm -hmm. with Evangelist Felicia Sims. And we have Jesus Reigns Restoration, Restoration Ministry. Ministry. Amen. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. And this is part three of our lesson. Let God be God. Let God be God. We, we have a saying, let go and let God. Amen. But the Lord is saying, be still. Amen. And, 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 and see the salvation of the Lord. Amen. 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 And again, uh, I just want to say that God is omnipotent. And to be omnipotent is to have unlimited power. To have authority. Mamlaka uweza usiokuwa na mipaka. All powerful, almighty God. Mwenye nguvu, Mungu mwenyezi. Amen. Amen. And that's who Jesus is. Ndio Yesu Kristo aliye, alivyo. For hallelujah in Matthew 28 and 18 and Jesus came and spoke unto them saying, All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Read that, please. Matayo, mataka, mtakatifu, kumina nane, kumina nane, shina nane, kumina nane, nasema. Yesu wakaja kwa wakasema nao, akawambia, nimepewa mamlaka yote, linguni na duniani. He, he got all power. Ana mamlaka yote. He made it clear, he's saying it in his word, he's telling you that I'm God. Ametuambia wazi hapa kwenye maandiko. Kwa maye ndiyo. I have the authority. Ana mamlaka yote. And the authority in which, hallelujah, when, when he preached, when he was, uh, Preaching in the synagogue and preaching on the street before the people, the word of God said he spoke with authority. Amen. Amen. Jesus, who is the author and finisher of our faith. Amen. Amen. Jesus made it clear, I am the way. The truth and the life. The truth and the life. No man go to the Father but by me. You pray me and I'll pray the Father. Hallelujah. He got all power. He's omnipotent. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And he... Command us with that authority and power to go therefore and all go therefore and teach all nations, baptize them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost, teaching them, teach them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. It's a commandment. <laughs> Mkiwa batiza kwa jina la baba na mwana na roo mtakatifu. And lo, I am with you always, even unto the end of the world. Amen. Anasema shirini na kuafundisha kuyashika yote nilio wa amuru nini. Na tazama mimi nipo pamoja nani, siku zote, hata ukamilifu wa dahari. Jesus is hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, God almighty, omnipotent. And he, and he reigned. Yuko anatawala na yuko maeneo yote. He reigneth. Anatawala. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And there's no end to his kingdom. Hakuna mwisho eti mpaka wa ufame wake. Thank you, Jesus. Asante Yesu. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And Exodus 3 and 13 and 14. Read those two verses, please. Kutabu cha kutoka 3, 13 na 14. Tasoma katika jina Musa akamwambia Mungu, tazama nitakapofika kwa wana wa Israeli na kuambia, Mungu wa baba zenu amenituma kwenu na wataniuliza, jina lake ni nani? Niwaambie nini? 
Mungu akamwambia Musa, mimi niko ambaye niko. Mo- A- sorry. Hallelujah. Continue. Akasema ndivyo utakavyo waambia wana wa Israeli. Mimi niko amenituma kwenu. Exodus 3 verse 13 and 14 and Moses said unto God Behold when I come unto the children of Israel and shall say unto them The God of your fathers have sent me unto you and they shall say to me What is his name What shall I say unto them And God said unto Moses I am that I am and he said thus shall thou say unto the children of Israel I am have sent me unto you he is god i am that i am i'm god who sent well, who what i'm going to tell the people who that who sent me he said i am that that says it all i'm god Anybody got a brain in their head know what he mean but he say I am. Yoyote mwenye akili mwenye ubongo kichwani mwake anaelewa anaposema mimi niko. Amen. 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 In John 8 and 57 and verse 58 Then said the Jews unto him Art thou yet 50 year thou art yet not 50 years old and have Thou seen Abraham? And Jesus said unto them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, Before Abraham was, I am. Read those two verses, please. Mstari wa, wakati wa kitabu cha Yohana mtakatifu nane, msina saba na msina nane, tasoma katika njina labwana, basi wa Yahudi wakamuambia, wewe hujapata bado miaka hamsini, nawe umemwona Ibrahim? Yesu wakawambia, amin amin na wambia. Yeye Ibrahim, asija kuwako mimi niko. They wanted to kill him because he said, before Abraham was, I am. Basi wakawakota mawe ili wa mtupie, lakini Yesu, akajificha, akatoka hekazi. They heard it from Moses when he said, when Moses went to him and said, I am sent me. Walisikia kutoka kwa Musa akisema hilo neno. And they took up stones to try to stone him but Jesus left from their presence without harm. Wakachukua mawe, wakachukua mawe kumpiga lakini Mungu akamsaidia akajitoka. Amen. Amen. Mungu akuruhusu. John 18 verse 4 through verse 9. Yohana 18 takatifu. Chapter 18 verse 4. Jesus, therefore, knowing all things that should come upon him, went forth and said unto them, Whom seek ye? They answered him, Jesus of Nazareth. Jesus said unto them, I am he. And Judas also, which betrayed him, stood with them. Read those verses, please. Uh, four to five. Four and five. Tasa soma katika njina la buwana, Yohana mtakatifu kumina nane, nene na tano. Basi Yesu, hali akijua yote ya takayo mpata, akatokea, akawambia, ni nani mnae mtafuta? Wawo wakamjibu, ni Yesu mnazareti. Yesu wakawambia, ni mimi. Yuda nae, alie msalite, alikuwa mesimama pamoja nae. At this time, Jesus has sold out, I mean, Judas has sold out Jesus for 30 pieces of silver. And he said, the one who I kiss is he. And Jesus said, Judas betrayeth thou with a kiss. But here, he said, that you see, who are you seeking after? And they said, Jesus of Nazareth. He said, I am he. Note the words, I am he, I am, that I am. Amen. We got to let God be God. Hallelujah. And we have to have ears to hear and eyes to see for God to heal us 
and save us. Tunatakiwa tuwe na masikio ya kusikia na macho ya kuona ili Bwana atuokoe na atuponye. And verse 6 As soon as soon then as he had said unto them I am he they went backwards and fell to the ground. Read. Basi alipoambia ni mimi msari wa Satan nasoma wairudi nyuma wakaanguka chini. Then asked he them again whom seek ye? And they said, Jesus of Nazareth. Jesus answered, I have told you that I am he. If therefore ye seek me, let these go their way. Read, please. Yesu wakajibu, nimekwisha kuambia, samani, saba, tarudia katika jina buwana, basi ya kauliza tena, mna mtafuta nani? Wakasema Yesu mnazareti. Yesu wakajibu, nimekwisha kuambieni ya kwamba ni mimi basi ikiwa mnanitafuta mimi waacheni hawa waende zao 7 and 8 verse 9 that the same might be fulfilled which he spoke of them which thou givest me have i lost none amen said wa tisa ili litimizwe lile neno alilolisema wale ulionipa sikumpoteza hata mmoja wao the Lord in Deuteronomy, let him speak to your heart. Deuteronomy 32, 39, and verse 40. See now that I am. Correction. Thank you, Lord. Deuter again, Deuteronomy 32, verse 39 and 40. See now that I, even I, am he. And there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. For I lift up my hand to heaven and say, I live forever. Amen. Amen. Read those verses please. Tasoma 39 na 40 katika jina la Bwana Yesu. Fahamu sasa ya kuwa mimi nam, mimi ndiye, wala hapana Mungu mwingine ila mimi. Na uwa mimi na huisha mimi. Nimejeruhi tena na ponya. Wala hapana awezaye kuokoa katika mkono wangu. Maana nainua mkono wangu mbinguni na kusema kama mimi niishivyo milele. Again, he's God Almighty. Yeah, ni Mungu mwenyezi. He's God omnipotent. Ni Mungu ambaye hayani hana mpaka. The stone in which the builders rejected. Jiwe ambalo wajenzi walilidharau walikata. Has become the chief cornerstone. Nimekuwa ndio jiwe la msingi katika kona la. Amen. That's Jesus Christ. Huyo ni Yesu Kristo. Amen. Amen. Jeremiah, hallelujah. But it's the Lord to say I I kill, I make alive, I wound, I heal, I have the power. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I sent to you. But it is God's will that we have life and have it more abundant. It is God's will that none shall per none shall be lost. But that all may come to the knowledge of the truth. That all might be saved. Amen. Hallelujah. It's important that we know the will of the Lord. It is important that we know the purpose of the Lord. Romans 8.28 All things work together for the good of them that love the Lord. That are called according to his purpose. Amen. Not some things, but all things. Work together for your good. Amen. Amen. It'll work, hallelujah, if you call on the name of the Lord. If you let God be God. And it, but it's got to be a, according to his will, according to his purpose. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Jeremiah 32 and 17. 
Yeremia 32:17. Yea, Lord God, behold, thou hast made the heaven and the earth by thy great power and stretched out arm, and there is nothing too hard for thee. Read, please. Ah, Bwana Mungu, tazama, wewe umeziumba mbingu na nchi kwa uweza wako mkuu na kwa mkono wako ulionyoshwa. Hapana neno lililo gumu usilo liweza. Amen. As I said earlier. Kama nilivyosema hapo awali, I illustrated that he did create the heaven and the earth. Ameumba mbingu na nchi. Amen. In six days and the seventh day he rests, the seventh day. Siku sita na siku ya saba ya sabato akapumzika. Amen. Amen. And here he he hallelujah with his mighty arm and stretched out arm he did it. Na mkono wake hodari alitimiza hivyo. Hallelujah. Verse 18. Thou showest love and kindness unto thousands and repentance the iniquity of thy fathers. Hallelujah. In the bosom of their children after them. The great, the mighty God, the Lord of hosts is he is his name. Amen. Amen. Repeat. Wewe uarehimuye watu elfu nyingi uwalipae baba za watu uovu wao vifuani mwa watoto wao baada yao Mungu aliye mkuu aliye hodari bwana wa majeshi ndilo jina lake Amen Yet we hallelujah the Lord he showeth love and kindness and his tender mercies towards us every day Bwana utuonesha rehema zake na neema zake kila siku earlier, new mercies every day Kama nilivyosema neema mpya kila siku Amen Amen unto thousands Kwa maelfu millions ma million many wengi Hallelujah Hallelujah The word of God say he did so many great works that if they were all put in books the earth cannot hold them. Na maandiko anasema ameyafanya mema mengi. Wangeandika vitabu ulimwengu wote huu usingetosha kubeba vitabu hivyo. And hallelujah he re, 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 uh, repentance the iniquity the sin that our fathers have done through various generations. Maovu ambazo baba zetu wameyafanya vizazi na vizazi vilivyopita. No more that he will go down uh, two and three generations to punish us for what our fathers did. Hawezi kwenda vizazi na vizazi kwa ajili kutuadhibu walio atenda baba zetu. It, the, it is written the uh, the soul that sinner shall die. Kwa maana imeandikwa ni nafsi itendayo dhambi hiyo ndio itakuwa. The just shall live by faith. Mwenye haki ataishi kwa imani. Amen. Amen. Verse uh, 19 Great in counsel is the Lord. Great in counsel and mighty in works. For thine eyes are open upon all the ways of the sons of men to give every one according to his ways and according to the fruit of his doing. Amen. Amen. Read please. Kumina tisa. Mkuu wa mashauri mweza katika kutenda ambaya macho yake ya mefumbuka juya njia zote za wanadamu kumpa kila mtu wa kadri ya njia zake na kwa kadri ya matunda ya matendo yake. God's word is wisdom. Neno la Mungu ni hekima. The, the, the fear of God is the beginning of wisdom and knowledge in him. Kujua hofu ya Mungu ndio mwanzo wa hekima na kumjua katika yeye. Amen. Read the word of God and, and, and let God speak to your heart and give good counsel, wise counsel, holy counsel to your spirit. Soma neno la Mungu Ujue Bwana Yesu Kristo mwokozi wetu anataka nini upate ushauri mwema kwa ajili ya nafsi yako Amen good counsel good word amen Ushauri mwema neno jema Amen cuz he said my word is spirit and it is life Kwa maana amesema neno langu ni roho na ni uzima Amen Amen Hallelujah and the mighty works of the Lord Amen Kazi kubwa za Bwana We will praise him for and the eyes of the Lord are on the sons of men. He he's watching. He see everything. Everything is naked in God's sight. And if it's sin, God will pull the cover on it for everybody to see. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
and God sees the fruit of your doing. Wana naona matunda ya matendo yako. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. God knows what we do from day to day. For his eyes are always on the righteous and our ear, his ears are always listening to our prayers. But the wicked he have no pleasure in. Again, the wicked he's mad with every day. For he see that their day is coming. The Lord shall laugh at them. For he see it that that day is coming. Amen. Amen. Isaiah 55 and 11. Just repeat what I'm saying. So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. Livio neno langu zinalo toka kwenye kinyo changu. It shall not return unto me void. But it shall accomplish that which I please. And it shall prosper in the things where to I send it. Amen. God word will not return to him void. It's not going to return back unto him, but it's going to go forth. It's going to please him. Amen. If you let God be God. Hallelujah. And let the word do the work in your life. Hallelujah. It will not leave you. Because the word is the Lord. Amen. Amen. And hallelujah. And he said, well, the word is the Lord. What do you mean by that? The Neno word Bwana. became flesh and dwell among us Neno when he came down to 40 and two generations. Vizazi There's three in heaven that are one. Una wawili, wa tatu mbinguni ambao ni wamoja. Amen. The Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. Baba, neno, and na they na are one. Na ni wa, na ni Amen. Jesus is the Holy Ghost. Jesus is the Word. Jesus is the Father. Yes, so, baba. Amen. Me and my Father are one. Hallelujah, Jesus say. I believe God. Amen. Amen. And he... In, Hallelujah, you're going to prosper, hallelujah, from God's word, from Christ being in you. And wheresoever God send it, remember all things work together for the good of them that love the Lord that are called according to his purpose. Sawa sawa na mapenzi ya mungu kwa wale wa mpendawe. But also many are called but few are chosen. Lakini pia tumambiwa wengi wa meitwa wa chache wa meteuliwa. Amen. Amen. Many will not go to the battle. Wengi hawata enda kwenye vita. Many don't want to be a watchman on the wall for the Lord. Wengi hawataki kuwa walinzi kwa jili ya buwana. Many don't want to proclaim this great gospel. Wengi hawataki kuubiri hii njili. Amen. Amen. So we are in between two opinions. And there are many that are serving two gods. You cannot serve two gods. Again, you will love one and hate the other. Amen. Amen. It says here. Uh, Psalms 15, 115 and 3. But our God is in heavens. He have done whatsoever he have pleased. Amen. Nasema hivi katika jina la Bwana Zaburi 115:3. Lakini Mungu wetu yuko mbinguni ametenda kile akipendacho. We talk about his authority. Tunazungumzia mamlaka yake. On earth as it is in heaven. Duniani Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus, as in the Lord's Prayer. Kama kwenye sala ile tunaita ya baba yetu. Turn your Bibles to Colossians. Tuelekeze biblia zetu kwa Colossae. First chapter, and we'll start at verse 12. Sura ya kwanza, tutaanza mstari wa kuminambili. 
Amen. And it says, hallelujah, I want you to, uh, I'll begin to read. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Give thanks unto the Father, which hath made us meet to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light. Nkimshukuru Baba, alie wastahilisha kupokea sehemu ya urithi wa watakatifu katika nuru. Let's give thanks unto the Lord for being having an inheritance, being heirs of Christ and having an inheritance among them that are sanctified. For we are the children of God. Verse 13, who have delivered us from the powers of darkness and have translated us into the kingdom of his dear son. Read. Nae alituokoa katika nguvu za giza akatuhamisha na kutuingiza katika ufame wa mwana wa wapendo lake 14 in whom we have redemption through his blood even the forgiveness of sin read ambaye katika yeye tuna ukombozi yani msamaha wa dhambi who is the image of the invisible god the firstborn of every creature which is jesus read naye ni mfano wa mungu asiyeonekana mzaliwa wa kwanza wa viumbe vyote hallelujah for by him were all things created that are in heaven and that are in earth visible and invisible where they be thrones or dominions or principalities or powers all things were created by him and for him. Amen. Amen. Read please. Kwa kuwa katika yeye, vitu vyote viliumbwa, vilivyo mbinguni, na vilivyo juu ya nchi, vinavyoonekana na visivyoonekana, ikiwa ni vitu vya enzi au usultani, au enzi, au mamlaka, vitu vyote viliumbwa kwa njia yake na kwa ajili yake. Things created in heaven or earth that are visible that you can see with the naked eye and things that you cannot see. There's things in heaven, there's things on in on earth and in the earth and even under the sea that we're not supposed to touch or handle. Kuna vitu viko duniani hapa juu angani kwenye nchi na chini ya maji na chini ya nchi and every knee shall bow of things in of those in heaven and those on earth and those that are under the earth. Amen. And every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. He's Lord. So it's going to be some knees and some mouths in heaven and on earth and under the earth that we don't see. And everybody going to have the same testimony. I don't care what religion you profess to be. Who you are, what people. You're going to confess that Jesus is Lord. As the people, when they seen the fire come down from heaven, and consume the altar and consume the water and consume the sacrifice they said the lord is god utaona watu watakiri wakiona ule moto watasema yesu ni bwana hallelujah hallelujah amen amen and here uh verse 17 and he is before all things and by him all things consist and he is the head of the body, the church, who is the beginning, the firstborn of the dead, that in all things he might have the preeminence. Amen. Amen. Read, please. Ni mzaliwa wa kwanza katika wafu ili kwamba awe mtangulizi katika yote. That he may we we talk about we talk about Jesus. Tunamzungumzia naye tunamzungumzia Yesu Kristo. Amen. Don't be going and looking at other gods and 
in other religions, it's one Lord, there's one faith, there's one baptism. Say please. Usiende uko kuzungwa zungwa kutafuta dini zingine na miungu mingine. Kuna mungu moja, buwana moja, ubatizo moja. One God, above all, mungu moja juu ya yote, through all, pitia yote, and in you all. Na ndani ya yote. Amen. Amen. God is one and we are, we, hallelujah, are one with God in the church. Mungu ni moja katika kanisa. Being in the body of Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And he has the preeminence. He has the authority. He has all power. I am that I am. The Lord testify of it. In Revelation, he say, I am Alpha, I am Omega. I'm the beginning and the end, the first and the last. Amen. Amen. Alpha and Omega. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Verse 19, for it pleased the Father that in him should all fullness dwell. Talking about the God the Father, it pleased him. That in Christ Jesus, the Son, that all fullness dwell. For the Lord said, hallelujah, he came to uh the disciples, when they wanted to make three tabernacles, when Jesus was on the Mount of Transfiguration, with Moses and Elias, concerning his crucifixion, and the disciples said, we can make three tabernacles. But God the Father, he came and he said, this is my beloved son. Hear he him. You listen to him. You follow him. God the Father gave instruction. You follow him. I give instruction. I gave authority to my son. You follow him. Amen. Amen. And it's God the Father when Jesus went to John the Baptist to be baptized. He said, hallelujah, suffer to be so now, we must fulfill all righteousness. And he came straight way out of the water, and the Holy Spirit descended as a dove, and God the Father said, this is my beloved son, and whom I am well pleased. Tunaona, baada Yesu Christo kubatizwa, akangukia huwa, akangukia juu ya kichwa chake. Akasema, huyu ndiye mwanangu, nipendezwa enaye. Amen. Amen. Verse 20, and having made peace through the blood of his cross by him to reconcile all things unto himself, by him I say, whether there be things in earth or things in heaven. Read please. Ishirini, na kwa yeye kuipatanisha vitu vyote na nafsi yake akiisha kufanya amani kwa damu ya msalaba wake. Kwa yeye, ikiwa ni vitu vilivyo duu ya nchi, au vilivyo binguni. Verse 21. And you that were sometimes alienated and enemies in your mind by wicked works, yet now have he reconciled in the body of his flesh through death to present you holy and unblameable and unreproachable in his sight. If you continue in the faith grounded and settled, and be not moved away from the hope of the gospel which ye have heard and which was preached to every creature which is under heaven whereof I, Paul, was made a minister. Read 21 through 23, please. Shina moja, paka shina tatu, kasika njina la buwana. Na nini mlio kuwa hapo kwanza mefarakanishwa tena adui katika nia zenu kwa matendo yenu mabaya amewapatanisha sasa katika mwili wa nyama yake kwa kufa kwake ili awalete ninyi mbele zake watakatifu wasio na mawa wala lawama mkidumu tu katika ile imani hali mmewekwa juu ya msingi mkawa imara msipogeuzwa na kuliacha tumaini la injili Mlio sikia habari zake iliyohubiriwa katika viumbe vyote vilivyo chini ya mbingu ambayo 
Mimi Paulo nalikuwa muhudumu wake. Hallelujah. You know, it, this Holy Ghost in which we have is real. God is real. Hallelujah. Not by my power, not by my might, but by my spirit, says the Lord. And, and we've seen, hallelujah, hallelujah, people that were, were, were addicts, people that were drunks, people that were prostitutes, people with, with mental issues, and health issues be healed in the name of Jesus. Be delivered and saved in the name of Jesus. Their lives have turned from a curse to a blessing. After that, you receive the Holy Ghost, you receive power. And we thank God for the power of the Holy Ghost. And first John 1 and 1. I want you to turn there, please. Turn there. First John 1 and 1. And I'm going to read this. And things that we have done and things that we've experienced in the body of Christ. And it says, that which we, from the beginning, which we have heard, which we have seen with our eyes, which we have looked upon, and our hands have handled of the word of life. And the life was manifest, and we have seen it, and bear witness, and show unto you the eternal life which was of the Father, and was manifest unto us that which we have seen and heard declare we unto you, that ye also have fellowship with us. And truly our fellowship is with the Father and with his Son, Jesus Christ. And these things write we unto you that your joy may be full. Read verse 1 to three, verse 4, please. Kwa kwa kwanza wa Yohana, moja paka nne, tatuma katika nina na buwana. Lile lililo kuwako tangu mwanzo, tulilo lisikia, tulilo liona kwa macho yetu, tulilo litazama, na mikono yetu ikali papasa, kwa habari ya neno la uzima. Na uzima huo ulivihirika nasi tumeona, tena tuamshuhudia. Na kuwahubiri nini ule uzima wa milele uliokuwa kwa baba uka dhihirika kwetu hilo tulilo liona na kusiki, kulisikia tuwahubiri na ninyi ili nanyi pia mpate kushirikiana nasi na ushirika wetu ni pamoja na baba na pamoja na mwana wake Yesu Kristo na haya twayaandika ili furaha yetu itimizwe Things that we have handled with our hands, we have seen with our eyes. Of God's healing and deliverance. The miracles and wonders that are manifesting God's church. Amen. Amen. The salvation of Lord of the Lord, hallelujah, blessing the souls of many people. With peace and joy of the Holy Ghost. Jesus said we we witness in which we've seen and what we do, but you don't accept our testimony. As many won't receive our testimony or our witness. Hallelujah, but we decided a long time ago for Christ we live and for Christ we die. And we won't let nothing separate us from the love of God. Why? Because we're going to allow and let God be God. Amen. Amen. And hallelujah, and our conclusion of our reading, Revelations. 22 and 7. The Lord said, Behold, I come quickly. Bless, blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of the prophecy of this book. Read, please. 
Nasoma saba katika nyela ya Bwana Yesu Kristo. Na tazama na ya upesi. Heri yeye ayashikaye maneno ya unabii wa kitabu hiki. 22 and 11. Jesus said, he that is just, let him be just. Uh, uh, correction. He that is unjust. Thank you, Lord. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. And he that is filthy, let him be filthy still. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. Hallelujah. Read, please. Kumina moja, mwenye kudhulumu, na azidi kudhulumu. Na mwenye uchafu, na azidi kuwa mchafu. Na mwenye haki, na azidi kufanya haki. Na mtakatifu, na azidi kutakaswa. And behold, I come quickly. And my reward is with me to give every man according as his works shall be. Kumina mbili, tazama na jaupesi. Na ujira wangu upamoja nami, kumlipa kila mtu, kama kazi yake ilivyo. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. Mimi ni Alpha na Omega, mwanzo na mwisho, wa kwanza na wa mwisho. Blessed are they that do his commandments, that they may have right to the tree of life and may enter in through the gates into the city. Heri wazifu wao nguo zao, Wawe na amri kuendea huo mti wa uzima na kuingia mjini kwa milango yake. For outward are dogs and sorcerers and whoremongers and murderers and idolaters and whosoever loveth and maketh a lie. Huko inje wako mbwa na wachawi na wazinzi na wawaji na hao waabuduo sanamu. Na kila mtu apendaye uongo na kuufanya. I, Jesus, have sent mine angel to testify unto you these things in the churches. I am the root and offspring of David and the bright and morning star. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Amen. Na mimi yesu ni mtuma malai, uh, what, what, what's the last verse? Verse 16. 16. And, and verse 21, please. 16 and 21. Mimi yesu, ni mtuma malaika wangu kuwa shuhudia nini mambo hayo katika makanisa. Mimi ndimi nilie shina na mzao wa Daudi. Ile nyota yenye kungaya asubui. Amen. Nema ya buwana yesu kriso na iyo pamoja nani nyote. Amina. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. This concludes our lesson. Let God be God. Let God be God. Amen. Amen.